Spotify has been the best partner to me. I am so grateful for everything Spotify has provided me in my deal. And so anything obviously I can do to participate, to help get the word out of like all the new advancements that Spotify is doing means so much to me because it is genuinely affecting my every day to day. Um, Spotify platform, ha platform having updates is like everything that affects my show. So I'm like very invested in also what's happening, but also happy to be here because I love Spotify. Um, it is very surreal, even like hearing that, it sometimes doesn't click to me, but I love my job so much and I am so passionate about what I do. I love my fans so much. The daddy gang is everything to me. So as much as like the number and everything sounds incredible, just knowing that I'm reaching a certain amount of people is really what's exciting to me as a creator. I think the beautiful thing about podcasting is it's a long format. A lot of times I think a lot of celebrities are going on to a show and it's like, you got 10 minutes, like tell us about your life. And I don't think that facilitates an environment where someone's gonna feel cozy and comfortable to share something. I think in order to have a conversation, even outside of a medium of podcasting, you wanna make sure the person sitting across from you cares what, about what you're talking about. And so I think Call Her Daddy does a really great job of showing the people sitting across from me, like I am I'm genuinely invested in your story and I want to get to know you and I want to do right by you. So I want you to feel comfortable to open up and share. Even if we're sitting here for two hours, we will let you hang out and share your story. And I think that's what makes it very personable. Yeah, I have been thinking a lot, obviously, about like who I'm gonna have on. The thing that's so interesting about Call Her Daddy is every single week I can have a plan of who I wanna have on next month. But because Call Her Daddy is so in the zeitgeist, I sometimes have to get on a plane and in 24 hours record an episode and upload it if there's drama or a, like a newsworthy thing happening. So unfortunately, I actually don't plan that far ahead. I have to be very in the moment with my show, which makes it, you know, I don't sleep a lot, but it's very fun. And I have a lot of exciting guests, but unfortunately I keep it so close to the chest because I like to roll out my promotions very strategically and I never tell anyone who I'm um, having on until it's like the minute of my announcement. I have so many people that it constantly is changing. Like I could sit here and rattle off like Rihanna or Jennifer Coolidge, Michelle Obama. Like there's so many women specifically that I would love to get to sit down with. But again, it's so hard because every week it's changing. I've had people on that I never anticipated that I would have on. It was like, oh, that is in the moment. Let's have this person on. And it ends up being so exciting. So I have like my dream list, but then I also have learned to know like, I gotta go with the flow. We're gonna see who's in the news that week. And then let's get them on Call Her Daddy. I would just say like, it's so cool to be able to create content that does genuinely impact people's lives. Like when I get the DMs from someone saying that they got out of a toxic situation because my show helped them or whether they were able to embrace a part of their sexuality that maybe they didn't feel comfortable doing prior. Like I think as much as we're having fun on Call Her Daddy, there's some true themes in my show that's allowing people to feel so connected sitting at home wherever they're watching and then be able to actually implement that into their life. So to me, Call Her Daddy is a brand because it's a lifestyle rather than just a show like people are taking this and and living and breathing it and that to me just I mean that's the ultimate goal as a creator I'm, I'm just so proud of it Great. thank you thank you very much. thank you thank you Watch your head.